For fishermen and seafood lovers alike, there's good news about ground fish. Along the west coast of the United States, especially in the Northwest, stocks of ground fish have been dramatically rebuilt after years of conservation restrictions to protect populations knocked down by a combination of poor ocean conditions and overfishing. And Pacific Seafood and its partners are playing a major role in this amazing comeback story. As the name groundfish implies, they are found on, in, or near the bottom of the body of water they inhabit, more than 100 species of them. Groundfish is really 100 plus species. It covers rockfishes, soles, cods, uh, things like pollock, Pacific whiting, an entire category. It happens to be one of the largest categories in the world. Some amazing, amazing flatfish. But not long ago, ground fish were almost entirely depleted along the west coast of the United States. There was very poor management from science, from industry overall, which led to a reduction in overall availability of the fish. What was happening in the 70s and 80s was that the ability of the fleet to catch fish kept increasing a bit, and the, the management agency, the Pacific Council, wasn't really keeping up in terms of controlling the catch, uh, especially of some of the species that were more vulnerable. There were stocks of ground fish, particularly rockfish, that were seen as way over harvested. When I got here, there was an effort now to start developing a more rational fishery uh, through a set of permits. So they would permit the available vessels. Rather than working against the science community, we started, I mean, you know, we started kind of getting together and planning out. This is an amazing success story right here on the West Coast that came from failure, brought together collaboration from community to fishermen to processors and industry all together. The fishermen have been working with the federal government's National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration since 1998. Watching the new management system increase crown fish and other species yields year after year. You know, science has actually helped the fishermen in a lot of aspects, being able to, to go catch fish that we weren't allowed to catch to show how much is out there, and now it's just kind of opening up. I mean, they certified it sustainable. The Marine Stewardship Council is set up to provide a label for environmentally friendly seafood products, and we do that by having a fishery standard that looks at are the stocks healthy, are the ecosystem impacts managed for and reasonable, and is the fisheries management system effective? The industry and the fisheries managers, the fisheries management agency, some conservation organizations worked together and came up with a plan to implement what's called a, a catch share system, which provided individual shares to fishermen on a species by species basis. We partnered with uh, groups like Marine Stewardship Council, uh, Monterey Bay Aquarium, a number of other environmental uh, NGOs and now all of them have looked at this as a poster child for success. Pacific Seafood participates in a number of different certifications and, and they've been a very positive partner in trying to move fisheries forward for certification and we're, we're beginning to work with them more and more um, on, the, um, on the commercial end as well. You gotta make this job whatever you want it to be you know you, it's not a normal nine to five job you're never really off the clock never really on out catch our fish bring the bag up takes about a half an hour to get the fish down uh, and uh, we dump the fish out and the guys push it all down the shovels and we use our hose get it all down in the tank and then we uh, press the tank up with water so they're not sloshing around and then uh, start chilling the fish immediately. In about five hours, all those fish are down to 32 degrees. We can fish these fish every year, you know, and, and keep it sustainable enough to keep going back to the same fishing grounds because we're not wiping them out. Ground fish are at the very heart of what we do at Pacific Seafood. Pacific Seafood is, in fact, 
the premier processor and supplier of this species category. The exciting thing with ground fish that's happening out there, especially in the restaurant industry, is we're able to see it anywhere from a five-star restaurant to a taco truck to family-style restaurants. It has a great price point, it has a great story behind it, and it's for everybody's palate. The ground fish is, is basically the backbone of what we do. It's a 12-month-a-year fishery. You know, we have three, four guys go down to the boat, unload the boats, and then they come up, they go through a dewatering box, which takes off uh, what ice is on them, and they get weighed out per species, and they're iced as we weigh it. We have a designated sanitation crew to clean and sanitize the equipment, the machinery, and you know everything involved when it comes to processing. We have QA people on the floor at all times. We do quality checks from beginning to end. The panaflase goes down, it gets weighed, it goes through a skinner. Again, depending on what product form we're doing. It goes through a skinner, uh, then we have a team of people that uh, trim the fillets, then they weigh it and bag it, and then they get uh, boxed and labeled per that order. They leave that day on a PGT truck, Pacific Group Transport truck. It goes to a Clackamas from here, and then Clackamas will, you know, they'll distribute it from there. So traceability is hugely important with Pacific. We have an APC system that when, when we weigh up a tote, we print out a tag, it's got a barcode on it, and you can follow that barcode all the way through our systems and back into the consumer. From the sea to the dinner plate, Pacific Seafood knows exactly when each fish was caught, processed, and delivered. The great thing about Pacific Seafood is we're able to manage it from the offloading through our processing centers all the way to our distribution centers and directly into our customers. You know, it's important that we control it for quality reasons, mostly. I mean, we gotta ensure the product's staying cold and it's being taken care of properly and it, it gets to the consumer in a timely fashion. One of our diamond philosophies is we will not ask for your business until we can help improve it. And with that, we need to sit down and, and have conversations with chefs and see where they're at. I use Pacific Seafood, somebody who cares about the product from when we order it to when we receive it. And that follow through just makes my job a lot easier and builds that trust. So I know that if there is ever an issue, I know who I can call and they'll handle it immediately. Uh, we just love the relationships that uh, we developed along the way. Uh, I made oyster and parmesan stuffed Dover sole with risotto and lobster bisque. And then I made braised rockfish with sauce veronique. Um, a very traditional French style dish. The sole, um, it does have a delicacy to it, but it's also, when it cooks up, it's firm, so you can kind of play around with it. The rockfish is really good for braising and poaching, and they're both very good fish for baking. The, the delicate texture with um, just the mild flavor, you can kind of use it with a lot of different ingredients, use it a lot of different ways, um, anything from mushrooms to fruit. Um, put it, a poached fish on top of a salad um, with a little bit of butter and it makes for an excellent lunch on the waterfront. It's fun to be on the ground floor of this basically new fishery and, uh, and help it develop it with, with, you know, with the team we got in Newport. Quality fish means people like it, they're going to buy more. It's healthy, it's good, it's quick to cook, it's fast, fresh food. It's creating more opportunity for everybody. You know, it's putting more fresh seafood into all the local uh, restaurants that wasn't there five years ago. When fisheries are managed sustainably and the ecosystem is, is still kept intact and productive so that you can still have whales, you can still have seals and sea lions, you can still have birds, uh, that's a good thing. Pacific Seafood's an absolute leader in quality, traceability, sustainability, and the overall assurance and guarantees that we give to our customers. I always have enjoyed working for this company. When you talk about innovation, they're very innovative. They're very involved, and they treat us well. They really do. We have about 100,000 metric tons of ground fish that are, can be legally harvested that are not harvested. That's enough fish, if laid end to end, to go around the globe at the equator one and a half times. It's a comeback story and we're all about that good stewardship and the sustainability and serving a quality protein on the plate. They're looking out in the abundant blue seas 
right here off of our west coast and want to really protect that ocean for not just them and that next week or that next month or that next year, but they're stewards of a resource and of their fish stocks for many generations to come.